outside, people will look at the goals and assists and maybe say you haven't got enough. Is that frustrating for you? Not uh, a little bit, but obviously I can see why people say it. I was sat down with the manager and and the analyst guys from, from City and, you know, they've shown me stats that you want to see as an attacking player that aren't goals and assists. Stuff like expected assists because that's like where you put the ball on the plate for someone. Yeah. And they haven't, they haven't <laughs> obviously, yeah, <laughs> so it's there for successful passes in the final third and stuff like this where, you know, I have been quite successful in. Also, when I look back at last year, I'd have certain assists where, you know, when they're all just going for you and they just, and they just go, like you put a ball in the box and someone gets on the end of it and then when you haven't got one, you put a ball in the box and it just gets headed out, you know, I think it's just, you know, that sort of look. Um, I just need a few to fall my way and then, and then they'll come. Okay, so your top three for touches in the box per 90, I think it's only Mo Salah and Raheem Sterling that are ahead of you, but you shoot a bit less. Is that something you're working on to try and get into goal scoring positions more to shoot more? I shoot way less than anyone. Like, even the guy, I'm not even sure, you know, the guys say to me, like, say if I score in training, like, the lad, like, why don't you shoot more? <laughs> I don't know, just sometimes when I'm on the pitch, if I feel like someone's in a better position, I'm going to pass it to them. Now, I had one the other month against Southampton when I had the ball in the box, but I passed it to Kev in the second half, and even after that, I was thinking maybe I should have shot there. Do you think you need to become a bit more selfish? Maybe, yeah. Um, but like I said, you know, I'm not, I don't really class myself as a selfish player. If someone's in a better position, I'm going to pass it to them. And I actually love assisting people as well. Like, I love the feeling of, of having an assist, you know, players like coming over and thanking you for their goal. The top three, the chances created in open play, does that go under the radar a bit? No, I see, I like that stat, because I don't take any set pieces. A lot of the guys that have um, big chances created in the Premier League, and I don't take any. That I take, like, as a good thing, because that's me, you know, creating chances, yeah, in, in, in open play. You're very relaxed. Pep Guardiola, maybe not so relaxed. How's he been with you? The most nervous I've ever been was like that first session at City where I felt like I had to, you know, prove that I was a good player, trying to impress, you know, the manager because he's such a, like, a big figure, you know, and I spoke to him so many times, you know, and him saying, you know, that he's been happy with the way I've um, been performing and stuff, but coming for the price tag that I come for, I know that I probably should have more goals and assists, um, and that's what I want, you know. And I, I'm deep down, I think everyone that knows me as a, as a footballer um, and has watched me for the past few years knows that I have so much more to give, and, and I definitely 